Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your computer is continuously restarting and you're coming across an error that says scanning and repairing drives, and then it might be a few percent complete or something like that, and every time you restart your computer, it just keeps scanning the drive, but eventually you boot into the Windows desktop environment. So I'm going to show you guys how to turn that off basically. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu, just left click on the start button one time, type in CMD, best manager should come back with command prompt, you want to right click on that, and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. Now before you begin, you need to know what drive letter Windows is installed on, so we're going to open up the start menu again, type in file explorer, so this is just for people that don't know where Windows is installed on. And if you select this PC on the left side, there should be a local disk with a Windows icon above the hard drive. In parentheses, this is the drive letter. So I'm going to have a couple commands in the description the video that are going to be very pertinent to this tutorial. And anywhere that there's a C colon on my computer and in my video case, you're going to swap that out with any other letter that's not C. So if your drive letter is D, F, E, anything from A to Z basically, you just swap it out with that respective letter. So kind of basically gave you guys a heads up for where we're heading with this video. So the first command I'm going to have is going to be in the description of the video. I want you guys to copy it directly from the description of the video like I said. So it's going to start with F-S-U-T-I-L. So just copy it and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt. Right click on it. Left click on edit and then left click on paste to paste it in. Hit enter on your keyboard. So now just copy the second command from the description of my video, go up to the top bar of the command prompt, right click on it, left click on edit, and then paste that in. Hit enter on your keyboard, give it a moment here, shouldn't take very long at all. And now once you have a blinking cursor, you should be good to go. So just close out of here, restart your computer, and that is it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.